so hello everyone welcome to your pedia education so there is one very important job update which is coming from office of the controller general of patents design and trademarks department for promotion of industry and internal trade ministry of commerce and industry government of india and this recruitment notification is for the position of patents and designs and it's a group a gadgeted position so in this released advertisement for electrical engineering for electronics and communication for computer science engineering there is huge number of vacancies and i guess if you are having bachelor degree in these all discipline you should apply for this position this is a great opportunity so they will be conducting three exams so if you are looking forward to prepare which i believe each one of you should who are eligible then we are attaching one google form down in the description you can fill that and show interest in preparation with your pedia education your pedia education is going to start one specific module separate module dedicated to as per the requirement of this exam pattern and we will be covering all section which include the preparation for preliminary exam then for the mains exam and then for the interview stage so if you belong to electronics communication electrical computer science and other engineering discipline and you want to avail this opportunity then fill the google form attached below and show your interest so now let's proceed ahead with the discussion so they had put some deadline for the recruitment this entire process will be concluded within 3 to 4 month you can see from 14th of the july the application process will start and 4th of august this application process will end and then first stage they will conduct preliminary examination that will be conducted on 3rd of september and on 13th of september the result will be out and then on 1st of october they will conduct the mains exam and on 16th of october the result of the main exam will be out and then on 11th and 12th november they will conduct interview and on 17th november they will share the list of the final selected candidate so the point is you need to write three exam preliminary mains then third stage is interview so within four month of the span this all will be executed so you don't have much time to prepare you need to start preparation from today only don't delay much and don't wait for the coming time that you will start preparation otherwise you will miss this opportunity we don't have a six month one year so guys i'm repeating again if you are looking forward to prepare please fill the google form attached down in the description because your pedia education is going to launch one dedicated module as per the requirement of this exam now which all discipline are eligible and what are the number of vacancies if i talk about the engineering discipline computer science engineering we have 63 number of vacancies for electronics and communication 108 vacancies and for electrical engineering 29 vacancies and for biomedical engineering we have 53 vacancies and then for mechanical engineering we have 99 vacancies there are few other branches textiles 8 vacancies metallurgy 4 vacancies for physics discipline we have 30 number of vacancies likewise we have some other sciences like biotechnology biochemistry food technology chemistry polymer science etc they also have the significant number of vacancies if you believe your past education or latest education is related to this discipline then you are equally eligible to apply for this position so wait for the deadline and apply next we have what is the structure of exam basically they have mentioned the eligibility for biotechnology you must have master degree for biochemistry master degree for food technology bachelor degree and if i talk about biomedical bachelor degree in biomedical technology or engineering for electronics and communication bachelor degree in electronics technology or electronics and telecommunication or its allied branches for electrical engineering bachelor degree in the electrical engineering or electrical and electronics engineering for computer science and it master degree in computer science information technology or bachelor degree in engineering technology in computer science information technology for physics they have mentioned master degree in physics or equivalent and similarly for civil mechanical metallurgy textiles they all are asking prerequisite the bachelor degree so this is the minimum eligibility criteria now the age limit is you must have attain at least 21 years and your age must be less than 35 you should not cross 35 on the last date of the submission of the online application now proceeding ahead what is the structure of exam they had mentioned very clearly there will be three phases of the exam the very first will be preliminary examination for screening of candidates for the main examination then it will be mains examination for shortlisting of candidate for the interview then final stage will be interview 
Now preliminary exam is merely a screening exam. They had mentioned this examination is meant to serve as a screening test and the marks secured in the examination will not be considered toward the declaration of the final list of the qualified candidate. Means your screening or preliminary don't have any contribution in your final selection. This is just conducted or executed to filter the number of students who are applying for this position. Then they have mentioned there will be men's exam, preliminary exam will be conducted online only and there will be 150 marks and this will be a multiple choice type exam okay and they have mentioned the duration will be two hours and 150 number of question will be there and all question will be related to non-technical general english verbal non-verbal quantitative aptitude general knowledge current affair general science ip legislation in india wipo and related treaties now they have told 20 times of the total approximate number of vacancy to be filled through this recruitment process right means through men's exam they will filter 20 times number of students for the final interview stage and regarding the men's exam if i tell for men's exam they have told there will be two paper paper one will be omr based and paper two will be descriptive paper Paper 1 will be 100 marks, paper 2 will be of the 300 marks and paper 1 will be of the 2 hour duration and will comprise of maximum of 100 objective type question which again carries the subject like general knowledge, current affairs, general aptitude, elementary mathematics, English language proficiency and knowledge related to intellectual property rights. IPR that is for the 20 marks this section which we call the paper 2 it will be the test of the knowledge of the candidate in its technical scientific discipline of the vacancy applied for paper 2 will be of the 3 hour duration and will comprise of the 300 marks having a descriptive questions and discipline wise syllabus is given below you can see they had mentioned the very detailed syllabus let me go down for biotechnology this is the entire syllabus you can check in the next year and then if I come down and go for the engineering you can see here if I talk about biomedical engineering for biomedical engineering you know this is the entire syllabus and this is all gate syllabus now if I talk about electronics and communication we have material and component we have physical electronics which we call the electronics devices and circuit then we have signal system network theory electromagnetic field theory EMMI analog electronics digital electronics control system communication system so entire gate syllabus is there similarly for electrical engineering entire gate syllabus is there guys so I told you in the beginning this position is a basically gazetted profile group a position and there are more than 100 plus vacancies in electronics and communication significant vacancies in mechanical around 99 for computer science and electrical engineering so if you believe you have passed education in this discipline don't miss this opportunity and don't forget to apply the process and form and start preparing from today only as i have told you they are going to sum up and conduct the entire preliminary mains and interview within the four month means you don't have much time so your pda education is starting a dedicated module for this from tomorrow only so you will be provided live classes and content with the resource material so if you are looking forward to prepare with your pda education feel to form the google form attached in the description we wish you all the best thanks a lot